Hello everyone, my name is John Lucas Gamars, and welcome to the first episode of our Torch Awards vlog series. In this series, we'll be showcasing how easy it is to fill out your Torch Award resume and how impactful you can be in your communities. Every month, we'll be posting a different vlog series about a different Torch Award category. And if you would like to participate in one of these episodes, more information is down below in the description. Now, for this episode, I'll be walking you through how I earn patriotism 705. Let's go. Welcome back. Now I'm going to actually show you guys how to log in your torch points right after you've earned them through the torch portal. So you would want to um, head over to register.bpa.org forward slash members and you're brought to this page. So you put in your membership ID, which is the login that your chapter advisor gives to you right after you've been registered in the beginning of the year. So you put in your login, your password and you log in and you're brought to this page. So you would want to click the fourth tab, which is Torch Awards. And it's brought to this overview and your Torch resume. And it looks a lot better after you've actually started to log in points. So I'll de demonstrate that after we've logged in the first one. So you're brought to this section with the seven categories and you click the activity, the activity and category you want. So we did patriotism. 705, which is to participate in an informative political session, which does not include being an observer, and this does not include student elections. So always read the, the information in the parentheses because it's really important. And then there's more information right here. So th this activity gives me 10 points, and I can only use this activity once. In other categories, in other activities, you could use it multiple times. But for this one, I can only use it one. And since I haven't used it yet, let's use it right now. Awesome. So you're brought to this activity date. Um, you would just put the activity date of when it happened. So for me, it was September 8th. So you enter your description, which has to be in full sentences with no grammatical um, errors. So read, I give that a quick read. And it's all set. So I click Submit and it has been submitted. So, and then you go to your overview and you see now it shows a progress bar of each of the four different levels of the Torch Award program for each different level. So I need a lot more points for all of these. So, and then when you click your Torch resume, it has all the activities, activities you've logged on so far. So I only have the one, but I'm getting there. So yeah, that's pretty much it. So if you have any questions, feel free to reach out to any of the national officers or your local chapter advisor. Any of us can help you log on your points. Um, but with that, start community service and start logging your torch points. See you around.